house. Hi Jessica. I'm Sue and I'm here to show you this great house at 783 North Skyline in Idaho Falls. Oh, I love Come it. Come on in. You can see there's some great siding. Yeah, the windows look beautiful. Single car garage. I bet this garden is gorgeous. Oh yeah, in the absolutely. Summer. Beautiful. Come on in. And great storm door. Yep. Nice and strong. Come on in, as you'll see, you walk right into this nice, spacious living room. So we're looking at this. Now, everybody has to look a little past because they're getting cleaned out. Yes. But there's great potential in here. There's absolutely great potential yes. in here. Wait till you see everything we have to show you. So big, bright living room. That looks beautiful. And then we have a coat closet, right? Let me look over yes. here. Yep, so you got a coat closet. This is quite a bit of room in this little coat closet right there. It's kind of hard to get into right now, but yep. there is a good size coat closet there. Um, as you can see, we have nice built-in features. I love those. That makes me remind me of the time when your grandmother had the china or the nigna. I love that. <laughs> I do too. So you can see there's this, this table in here. So you yep. know there's lots of room for eating inside the kitchen. Um, you can also see you have this nice big kitchen with lots of cabinets yes so and the cabinets look beautiful i mean you know yeah if you look past a little bit of getting things packed up but these are in, these are beautiful cabinets they actually yes and i think they're maple i'm not sure but that's mm -hmm. what they look like mm -hmm. because i have maple cabinets in my home and um this is it's such a nice warm color yeah. that goes with everything and you can i love it with the blue they're very sturdy and strong too yeah, look nice so um nice colors ceiling fan yeah big strong doors Go is it a fenced here. yard? Fully fenced yard. Oh, look at that. And you can see this cover here that's on the patio mm -hmm. that actually helps um, in the summer. You can have some shade and enjoy your yard. And it's a lovely deck. Right. You can see there's a, um, a gate back there. So alley access. You can get into the alley. Awesome. You can bring those things back here. And that... it's a double gate. So if you were trying to pull right. in a car. Oh, yeah. I love that. Right. And, of course, a bully barn in the back as well awesome. for all your gardening needs. Yes. Okay. And then if you want to follow me, over here it leads right into the area where there's the garage. Or you can go downstairs where it's fully finished. So you'll notice there's a one-car garage. Let me open the door. Dip. Lots of room oh, in this yeah. one car garage too. It's not tight at all. Lots no. of storage up and it's got great shelving. Yeah. Nice and they even have an extra extra door out back and a fridge. Yeah, that's a great garage. You could do some rafter storage up there because it's And really got tall. those big windows so it's not dark and scary in there. Yep. Beautiful. And then if you'll follow me downstairs. Down here we have a living room that has been, I don't know if you can hear me, mm -hmm. <laughs> a living room that's been um, paneled in with nice solid paneling. And so this room could be a great game room. Yeah. TV room. And there's no windows. And Theater. sometimes that's, that is awesome for an entertainment room. Yep. But if you wanted to have your TV, that, yeah, you bet. Yep. Of course. And then over here, we have a couple of bedrooms that are back here. So here's the green room, <laughs> <laughs> but there's a lot of windows in here. You yeah. have to look at this house and think of the potential. Because if um, those windows didn't have the shades on it, yeah, it would have plenty right. of windows. You would have lots of light in here. Let me step in and take a look at the closet. They actually have a lot of covering on there right now, so it really would be a lot lighter in here. So you have the closet. You, I don't know if you can tell on the video, but there's a lot of furniture in here. So this room is really big. Yeah. You could put a couple of bunks in here. Um, you could put, you could probably even fit a king in here and still have your furniture. So, and these are hard serve. It looks like it's painted concrete. So there's not carpet in this room, but right. they painted the concrete. Mm -hmm. And that's the same in here, in this room. With, again, like the other one, it has lots of windows. Mm -hmm. Um, and it, you know, it, it would be really, really bright. So closet, lots yeah, of space. Lots of space. Okay. And the wind and the ceiling is for this age. What year was this house built? Do you remember? 1957. That the ceiling's not low. No, actually, it's very. Yeah. Everything is really a good height yeah. in this house. So, 
Um, and then of course, it's nice to have this big wide hallway because if you've ever been in a basement in places, sometimes it can feel really cramped. Yeah. But between the big rooms and the wide hallway here, it just, it doesn't. There's a bathroom right here with a shower. Which is awesome to have a bathroom downstairs, a full mm -hmm. of shower and everything, yep. Yeah. And of course a window. Yeah, nice. And then... And you don't always get a window in a downstairs bathroom. Right. And yeah. then, yes. And then this is the utility room slash laundry. But what's great about this room is there's also a lot of storage back here behind the furnace. Lots of shelves. It's really hard to kind of show you, but it's oh, let me see if a I lot can, of space. Let me see if I can go in behind the furnace. So interestingly, this is built a little I can't really see. I see a coal chute on this. They said there's something interesting about the, the yes. heating. So you've got forced air. And oil. And oil. In okay. the ground oil tank. Got yes. it. Which is buried. Yes. So safe. Yep. Yeah. Buried. And then, of course, I don't know if, you know, the water softener and everything works, but um, but it's already plumbed for everything. That and is, it looks like a pretty new water heater. Yes. And if you look at all of this, it's in a great location, yeah. nice and convenient. So you can do all kinds of things in this room. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna go back upstairs because we missed a couple of things. We did! <laughs> so you know what I'm thinking about with Sue as we go back going upstairs is yes. that um, this would be a great Airbnb. We're on North Skyline, yes. which is right down from the airport. This has, what, four bedrooms? Four bedrooms. Two bathrooms. Yep. A fenced yard. If you were to Airbnb, to do this as an investment property, it would be, it would really be hot. This house has so much potential in a lot of ways. The Airbnb would always, probably always be busy. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it's also, said. a family could live here. That's right. I mean, This huh. is like a dream first home. It is. You have the two rooms upstairs, the two rooms down, the bathrooms, you have everything you can need. Yeah. Plus the fenced yard. Yeah, plus a fully fenced yard and a deck, a patio, it's lovely. Yes, the deck is beautiful. So here's the bathroom up here. So tub, yeah. One thing I wanted to point out about this is there's a lot of space. Yeah. You can tell, I mean, you know, they've done some things to upgrade it here. Mm -hmm. Then you have this. the countertop looks nice in good shape. Then you have this bedroom right here, which if you walk in there, the red room. Yes, you will see there is Big windows, lots yeah, of light. it's really bright. And lots of room. Yeah. One thing that people need to understand when they're looking at this video is there's so much space. There's 1,750 square feet here wow. that are finished and about 250 that aren't. Wow. So. Yeah. It's, it's, it's one you wouldn't, you wouldn't know from the outside. Yep. And then there's one more green room here. We're just nicknaming them. That's right. You're going to make it your own. <laughs> nice and bright, big room. Yes. This could easily fit a king bed in there. So as you said, Airbnb, a lot of people can fit in here. And then with the yard and yeah. the beautiful kitchen, yeah, it's just a no-brainer. Yeah, this is, this could, th there's a lot of equity in doing a little more to this house, but there's also, this is moving ready. Yes. It's fantastic. All right, so if they want to see this, how do they get a hold of you? Um, they give me a call at 208-918-6229. Perfect. All right. Come see it. It's hitting the market.